Good morning, 726. Thanks for watching. I'm Brittany Dobbins. The waters of the Mississippi are moving rapidly near the dam at the Rock Island Arsenal as we hit the river's crest this week. The National Weather Service's most recent update has the river near its crest between Rock Island and Davenport at around 20 feet, and it'll stay there most of this week. You can see it's still dry where Hasco barriers are protecting some businesses in downtown Davenport. These are at the foot of Iowa Street and River Drive. There's no water at all as of yesterday, but there is plenty of water where 3rd and 4th Streets meet River Drive. There will be detours around the area for a while. You can see here the water is about halfway up the construction barrels sitting on 3rd Street. On to the Illinois side of the river, this is Campbell's Island where some roads are underwater. It's up the entire part of a stop sign in one area. The water has come up quite a bit over the weekend. And the detours around River Drive are not the only headaches for drivers in Davenport this week. Today, work starts on a sewer project on locusts between Main and Brady Streets. Roads there will be closed and detours will be set up. That repair work is expected to take up most of the week. And sewer work starts today at Washington and West 17th Streets. That is also supposed to take up most of the week. Davenport is starting a project to improve intersections as well. Both are on Central Park Avenue near Genesis West Campus. The intersections with Division and Central Park are both being worked on, leading to some lane closures as they do the work. And that's your local news. Now here's Sean with your local Pinpoint Forecast. Hello everyone. So what we're going to be seeing is that we're going to be seeing some shower chances throughout the rest of today, though we did see some more showers uh, earlier this morning. We actually take a look here on our monitor. Just a quick little time lapse of what we were seeing overnight. You can actually see when that morning rain kind of moved through, but it is now cleared away for a nice look at our morning. So now here's a more live look of what we're seeing of our camera over in Bendorf. 68 is the, is the temperature right now, so it's a pretty fairly cool morning. Here's our live satellite and radar of the of the whole nation. Here towards home, we're seeing those showers starting to move away. Down towards Texas, we're seeing Hurricane Barrel make its way through Houston. So we can see that there, and it's going to continue moving there throughout the rest of, of, of the week. Temperatures right now across the, across the scope. Chicago seeing 71, and uh, again, us back home, we're seeing more into the upper 60s as we head on throughout the rest of the morning. Then your pinpoint seven-day forecast. We're going to be be seeing some clouds and storms throughout the rest of today and chance of tomorrow, but we're going to be warming up towards the end of next week and heating up towards the 90s for their for your upcoming weekend. All right. Thanks, Sean, and thanks for watching for news anytime, anywhere. Just go to our quadcities.com.